Hey guys, welcome back to more Judge Dread, Dread vs. Death. We are on Chapter 11, Dead World. Once an ordinary world not unlike Earth, what we call Dead World was once populated by people not unlike Earth people. They even had judges too, but there, but there the similarity ended. These judges led by Judge Death and developed their own mortal code, moral co code, which, re which reasoned that life itself was a crime and only the dead could be truly innocent. The dark judges were eventually responsible for destroying all life on their home planet. Yeah, that sucks. Hello? Yeah, Dread is really just kind of made out of wood or something. Or steel. Just plops down. That's a big beastie. I thought the world wasn't unlike our own. Oh, hello. Oh, and some vampires still. God damn it, jeez. Okay, I don't know if I'm supposed to be killing everyone, so I'll just, uh... Oh, hello. There's some judges here, too. Uh, I guess I have to kill everyone? If maybe this is blocking my way? Let's try it. Mm-hmm. Do they have, still have shoes on? Nothing but shoes? Oh, it looks like it. It's odd. Uh, slowly working my way through all my ammo. And I saw you. You might be sort of camouflaged, but I still saw you. More judges. The weapon I don't need. Hello. It seems like they just keep respawning, but... This game would have been so much better if there had just been, like, objective markers. Not some of the time, but most of the time. Sometimes I just... sometimes I do objective markers, but... Then other times I don't. It's really seemingly at random. I would assume I have to go here, but... Don't think I have to jump in there. <sighs> okay, where do I need to go? Oh, okay. So I did need to kill all of them. Hello. Oh, vampires. Sometimes they die really easily, and then sometimes they take fucking forever. But you can just give them two punches and they're dead. I, who needs bullets if that's... If it takes two punches to kill a vampire. Like a, a a punch gun, one of those cartoony ones that shoots like a big, uh, oversized boxing glove. I kind of want to save some of my life as well, if possible. 
or my ammo, I mean. Oh, okay. So it is just... What is this depicting? Just death killing someone, I suppose? Hello. Big building. Oh, and death cult members who should have been killed by Judge Death, presumably. Um, is this a better one? Oh, yes, it is. Because it's my grenade launcher. Ha. I'll take that. I think it's best if I just ignore most of them, unless I run into a place where I really can't continue on, and I probably have to kill a bunch. Hey. Knock it off, will ya? What are you? Oh, there was another one? Oh, okay, so I do have to kill a bunch of them. We can make that happen. Didn't want it, want it to come to this, but oh, I see that I'm also very much also dead, almost dead. there in the skin tight outfit oh fuck did I just have a checkpoint no just an updated objective I guess I just have to kill all the the living peeps <clears throat> the death cultist by the vampires and such. You can say death cult all you want, but it doesn't change the fact that Judge Death doesn't want any living things. Okay. Alright, that looks to be the final boss. That's Anderson? Yeah, that's Anderson. He wants to take his her body. What are you doing to the side, judges? Harnessing their psi energy. I will open a dimensional gateway between this world and yours. All life will be extinguished and Mega City One shall at last be purified. I've he stopped you for a you think you'll get away with it this time. The death cult was kind enough to provide me with this magnificent body. Oh. Icarus's sinful research into eternal life would seem to have its uses. I killed Icarus. A worthy attempt, but his serum had already so taken So that's effect. Icarus, then? Now his body is indestructible, and it is mine. I don't really get why he can just take over bodies now when it was like when they had a whole ceremony and stuff earlier, I think. Over my dead body. <laughs> okay. I hope the other vampires and whatnot 
aren't coming after me. They seem to be coming after me. Okay. God damn it. Okay, but that's what we have to do. It was just a little bit un- oh, fuck. Do we have to watch this? Okay. For a moment I thought we had to watch it every time. Okay. Don't mind me. Yeah, okay, he's not too fast. Yes, no, oh, fuck. Got stuck there for a moment. Alright, and then we can uh, have Anderson take care of him. Hmm? What's hitting me? There's nothing there. Will I now? Go help Anderson, then. So I just have to kind of wait, I suppose. And I'm out of ammo. Oh, fuck. All right, be right back. Alright, we're on to the last side judge again. Go help Anderson. I'll distract Judge Death. Guess I'll just kinda stay out of his way. Here, Judgey Judgey. Yeah, he's not attacking any of the other judges, I think. out of ammo again. Yeah, I only have a few bullets left. So are they gonna help? One more? Where, where's the last one? Okay. Was that objective complete on defeating Judge Death? God damn it, why are those things so strong? Yeah, welcome no back. No suction trap when you need one, is there? Guys, you know what to do. much of a uh, final boss then. Oh, yeah, I was wondering if that was what he was going to do. What? Judge Death is trapped within me. Oh, he's going to kill Anderson now? Okay. Uh... Okay. <laughs> I'm assuming there's a, a, another cutscene. Okay, yeah. We just eliminated the last of the vampires from Sector 5. The region infestation is over. Good work, Grant. Rest assured that we're stepping up security on the Dark Judges. What about Anderson? Containing Judge Death's essence was a terrible strain on her. But she's doing fine, thank you very much. Joe, you weren't worried about me, were you? Looks so good. Grid. Rock war in progress, corner of Reeves and Hopper. On my way, Control. Dread out. 
later. I guess we'll never know. Oh, that dread. Such a mysterious man. All right. Is that it? Yeah, that was Judge Dread Dread versus Death. It was not very good. It was not very good at all. I don't know if I if I would have played it like back in the day if it um, if I would have liked it more, perhaps. I mean, I I thought it was an enjoyable game. Uh, especially more towards the start. Um, but it's, it's just, it's just such a weird game. Like, it's weirdly paced. The, the, the AI is just weird and bad and some of the, of the design choices. It, yeah, I don't know. I, I think... Dread would make, like, the Dread setting is, like, perfect for a very cool game. Uh, definitely, like, I, I know some people wouldn't like it, but, like, sandbox style in, in Mega City 1, just being a, uh, being a judge and, and, uh, so solving crimes and stopping crimes, I think that would be fucking amazing. So it's a shame that Especially after the 2012 movie, um, I think there was a, a big interest in Dread again, and they could have definitely hopped on that ba bandwagon. I think they actually made some games after that, but it was all mobile, mobile games, which, I mean... I mean, there's fun mobile games, but it's always a shame that because they're just they're just not the same as like full on quote unquote real games. All right, and the, those were the credits. Um, so yeah, that was that was it. Um, yeah, raise rank, achieve cadet. Hmm. So, yeah, well, that was Dread vs. Death. Hope you guys enjoyed uh, watching me uh, kind of uh, complain my way through, <laughs> through it at times. No, but uh, like I said, I really like um, the setting. So, it's cool. I'm glad that I got to play in it a little bit, even if the game itself wasn't very good. Um, so let's hope that that rumored new game that they are working on supposedly um, is is good and not just like a mobile game. That it's an actual proper full-on Judge Dredd game. That would be fucking sweet. So yeah, thank you guys again very much for watching. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this uh, let's play of this old and uh, game that probably not a lot of people knew about or maybe knew about but forgot about don't bother picking it up because it's not very good but it's uh, fun enough to uh, play through it once or watch through it once I suppose so once again thank you very much hope you guys had fun and I hope to see you guys in the next let's play of a yet undetermined game so thanks see you guys and bye bye <laughs>